We're just 11 days from the start of the 2012 Summer Olympics in London, and most of Team USA's athletes are now on their way overseas for final preparations. That includes the U.S. Olympic swim team, which happens to be very heavy on Georgia flavor. Eyewitness Sports Director Keith Colley joins us with more. Well, many Team USA swimmers smiled as Rocky Top blared through the speakers last week at the UT Aquatic Center. Others cringed because the big orange surroundings were like enemy territory to a large group of Georgia swimmers. Wearing the red, white, and blue is the greatest of honors for any American swimmer. Yet on the 2012 U.S. Olympic swim team, the red and black is a close second. Once a dog, always a dog, so that's how it is. I mean, everybody on the team is great, but you always have that Georgia bond, like once a bulldog, always a bulldog. And Jack Bowerly is the tie that binds them. The top dog of UGA swimming is the winningest active NCAA coach and a four-time national champion. And this year, he has five current or former Georgia swimmers on Team USA. It's not a mistake that Jack keeps putting kids on the Olympic team, that's for sure. Um, he knows what he's doing over there. Four Georgia swimmers medaled in the 2004 games, and both Carolyn Joyce and Allison Schmidt stood on the podium in 08 when Bowerly served as Team USA's head coach. Being part of that Olympic pedigree prepares other Bulldogs for the big stage. Getting in the pool every day and Racing with those girls kind of fosters a confidence when you get to trials. You're like, I've raced these people, I train with these people. It kind of brings down the nerve level because that was my first trials as well. And I think it just speaks to how hard everybody at Georgia works. And it explains why many of the world's best swimmers want to be at Georgia. Not only does UGA have five reps on Team USA, but an additional seven current or former Bulldogs will represent six other countries at the London Games. Georgia always has had a team that without clicks and no matter the different personalities, we always come together and we have the same common goals. When you come to Georgia and you're around that, those people who have been to the Olympics and you see you know, the Olympic rings tattooed on your training partner's back. And it, to be in, around that program where that's a, a daily part of the, the routine, I think it, it's uh, something special. A dozen dogs will be representing Team USA in the pool for a second straight Summer Olympics, but the number of dogs in the water will actually be 13 because USA Diving Captain Chris Colwell also has ties to UGA. Uh, we'll have more coming up a little bit later in sports at 6, but for now in the studio, Keith Colley, Channel 3 Eyewitness Sports.